Hello everyone. Today I'm going to present real-time chat application uh, using Signaler and uh, we develop application using sp.net core and uh, database is MS SQL server. So we have two screen and left side is uh, for uh, from user and right side is to user. Let me log in one by one. I will give you just quick overview now. So left side is uh, I log in as a super admin user and if I go to the chat room then I can see all the chat participant list and here I need another user so that uh, let's say Birat Kohli so I'm just logging as a two user uh, which is Birat Kohli so in the left side is screen like I log in as a super admin who is Steve Smith, Steve Smith and the, from the uh, right side is screen who is Birat Kohli so Steve to Steve Smith to Birat Kohli so let me uh, send hi you can search uh, the participant Birat. so if i so here is the Birat. so hey, we already have some test chat and uh, let me say hi uh, from smith so this is the smith and i'm saying hi hello Birat. B -I -R -A -T. If I send, then definitely we'll instantly receive a here. Uh, this is the uh, Birat uh, login skin, and this is the Smith login skin. So chat with Smith. So, so hello Birat from Smith send. So we, as we can see, we are receiving real time message and uh, hi uh, Smith. If I send the hi Smith, then we can check. Uh, the real time we can receive the real time message as well so we can delete the message as well so this is the uh, uh, this is the uh, code overview of this application so i'm just uh, going to uh, details explanation one by one so we have built application using uh, so as i was talking we build this application using latest sp.net core uh, .NET Framework X6.0 and for real-time message communication we have used Signaler. So I will explain code base as well. So we, uh, I just uh, initially uh, given you the uh, uh, summary overview of this application, how is going to be uh, chat is done. So I just minimizing. I'm going to minimizing one screen and uh, sign out from the main screen. So this is the login screen of our application. So. Uh, you can create, update, and delete uh, the user details. And uh, in the chat room, you can check, uh, like, I let me log in as a super admin user. So in the chat room, you can, uh, uh, this is the main feature of this application. In the left side, uh, there is the participant of the chat. Uh, currently, just Smith and Virat Kohli is logging online. So uh, dynamically, we manage the online status as well. Other participant, this is the demo participant, is not uh, uh, currently is uh, not available. So we can search uh, the participant, let's say Virat and also the Shakib Al Hassan. So we can uh, we can uh, search the participant and also the select. If I going to select the Lionel Messi, so with Lionel Messi here is the already zero masses and chat with the Lionel Messi is uh, empty. So currently Lionel Messi or uh, is showing offline. So let me give you how it's going to be online. So I'm just going to hi hi Messi. And uh, uh, you in the message textbook, you can write multiple lines. And uh, this is uh, uh, here is the action button sent. If you press the send, then message will uh, send. So hi, Messi. Just we have a uh, we have here one sound because uh, the left side is screen is uh, login as a uh, uh, currently is login as a uh, Birat Kohli not Smith. So I'm going to uh, open another browser and log in with uh, Messi. Uh, so that we can check uh, the Messi online status and uh, communication with Messi. Also, we can send uh, test uh, multi-line messages. I'm just copying uh, Lorem if some now and sending. So we can send multiple messages, multiple text line as well. So we have a like timestamp. So you can see the message time and the user online status and you can delete the message as well. 
So we, uh, as a, uh, from the Steve Smith, uh, we send the uh, Lionel Messi, but uh, Lionel Messi is currently not available. If I going to log in uh, as a Lionel Messi now, uh, then uh, as, as I'm logging as admin user, now I can find the uh, Lionel Messi details so that I can log in. So here's the user list. And uh, if we go to the Lionel Messi uh, user details, so I need just, uh, we need just uh, Lionel Messi email address so that we can log in. Yes. So in the left, right side, I'm just going to log out and I will log in as a uh, Lionel Messi user so that we can check the Lionel Messi message status, matches with Steve Speed and Lionel Messi. So I successfully log in as a uh, Lionel Messi so we can see here is the Lionel Messi and uh, if we go to the chat room then uh, if we go to the chat room then we can see uh, the Steve and Steve, Steve Smith is showing online and uh, as a Lionel Messi uh, is also showing online if we select the Lionel Messi uh, Steve Smith sorry so we uh, receive two messages from hi Messi and the long text uh, and if we go to the, our main uh, admin panel uh, uh, browser in the chat room and uh, if we go down then we can see and also by searching uh, Lionel Messi then yes it's showing online so online status is a uh, dynamic and also the masses status so I uh, from Steve Smith uh, we sent uh, two messages to uh, Lionel Messi now uh, that this is time for reply back to the Steve Smith hi Smith yes we are receiving real time messages nice to meet you meet you here cricket code from the uh, Steve Smith. So we can see from the left side to right side real time communication and uh, we can receive the instantly messages also receive uh, the also playing the sound instantly. So this uh, instant uh, communication we have done uh, using or similar I will explain code base as well. So if we going to give you the application overview in the front end and the dynamically loading messages, uh, let me just give you a details overview. So this is the main screen of this uh, chat room application. So if we divide this application, uh, let's just if I select again like uh, Lionel Messi uh, here. So in the top bar, uh, there is a one view. Uh, view a partial view and the chat box is another partial view and the chat message uh, action with uh, send button and the uh, text box of message another so we have one two three partial view and the sidebar is another partial view so for partial view we uh, uh, we are make uh, make sure for partial view every time and uh, loading as a dynamic and deleting message just uh, uh, delete from this uh, list not uh, loading uh, entire message from the database and refresh it just we just uh, uh, delete single message also or the same things going to uh, if we're going to like uh, test uh, masses so we just add a new one message here and uh, in the database we just insert one not the loading everything so and also the total message also dynamic and uh, uh, and uh, the site where a uh, user profile is loading dynamically you can search the user profile for chat and uh, you can delete and check the timestamp so everything uh, we have done using a jquery uh, from the jquery code in the front end loading uh, the uh, four different view top and the middle the chat box and the action of the chat box and the site where and the search and once uh, we are going to save the database, we have uh, used code first and using entity framework in the, in the MS SQL database, we are just uh, saving the data. And if we talk about the how we are getting the instantly messages, uh, let's say, hello. See, we are uh, receiving instant messages. So let me give you just a code uh, base overview. 
So uh, let me just give you a code base overview. Here is my application. So in the JavaScript, we have uh, like uh, database operation JS and dynamically content loadings. I already explained we have four different view models, uh, sorry, partial view, uh, top and the chat box and the action of the chat and sidebar. And all have all we have done here dynamic content and the chat box signal R. in the signal R we are receiving uh, like uh, from the add new message we have uh, a done uh, code here and if we go to the just uh, basic uh, overview of this code so we are receiving a real time uh, signal here once we receive and with uh, we are receiving data you the result and based on the data we are loading like left to right masses here so this is uh, a bit uh, uh, bit uh, might be complex for you so because we have done a lot of things here and this is the add signal masses uh, in ul html uh, elements and also that signal masses to user elements also the append finally so this is the basic overview on the code base and in the left side and right side we are uh, receiving a real-time message and we can delete the message also real time so if you uh, if uh, if you give you details overview of this application so for real-time communication signalers is awesome and uh, we, we get uh, uh, we get wonderful uh, library like signaler using e simply we are getting instant messages and also uh, we divided the code in the uh, smaller part so that you can easily understand and so we have like uh, uh, database operation dynamic content part and the signaler part and the sidebar part we segregated each code separately so that you can easily understand and same going to the insert operation we are uh, we have used uh, entity framework core and also the loading operation from the database we have used uh, uh, message service to uh, communicate with one user to another user and also this application is supported uh, additional feature like uh, login history audit uh, audit log and also uh, uh, plenty of crude operation and complete user management and also the dynamically you can manage the role so uh, basic user can access uh, only his dashboard and chat room like uh, let me show you the left side of this application so uh, here is the left side of this application Lionel Messi is just a general user and login as a general user he can access only his dashboard and his profile as well and uh, if you uh, like this application you can enhance and add additional feature uh, like uh, real time uh, total masses uh, unread masses so this is the uh, work in progress currently so anyways if you are interested and like this application you can get complete source code with the documentations uh, from the code canyon so i was checking about emoji so you can use emoji as well let me just uh, share my one of the example here just i just copy hard uh, emoji and sending to uh, steve smith also from the steve smith uh, same things will happen Virat uh, is uh, receiving the hard emoji let me copy another emoji from the web and uh, I'm just popping uh, another random emoji. So, emoji is working as well. So, this is uh, some cool application uh, using latest ASP.NET code. You can uh, get plenty of features in this application like real time message communication, real time user online status, and the message stamps. Also, you can delete the message so real time uh just going to delete the last emoji see uh, message is deleted uh, deleted real time and uh, uh, this uh, complete application is uh, uh latest uh, .NET 6.0 and uh, database is uh, we have used in the demo version uh, ms sql server but you can use mysql and postgresql as well and the dashboard you can get the recent user and the uh, summary of this application so cool uh, cool feature of this application like chat module and uh, chat module uh, before uh, closing this video i'm just giving the final overview 
So in the front end, we have uh, write a raw JavaScript code by dividing this page and uh, four part like top header part and the action uh, message, uh, message action part uh, like text box and the send message and the message box. So message box, we have to load data dynamically from the database and also the handle the HTML elements dynamically. So uh, to handle HTML dynamically, we have uh, written uh, dynamic contents, uh, content uh, JavaScript. So here is our uh, dynamic content JavaScript code. So we have written uh, and uh, split the code uh, separately so that you can so that you can easily understand. I'm not going to explain the database part, controller part. So in the, another video, I, I will explain if required. So more, more important of this application and this video is uh, like how uh, Signaler uh, and the message is communicated and how we, how we are loading the message and how we are deleting the message and how instantly getting the message with the real time signal from the signal li library we are just uh, deleting and loading and adding messages also we are getting instant uh, real time user uh, online status and also the sidebar also we can search so thank you everyone watching this video and uh, I, I i expect uh, ho hopefully you like this application if you have any further feedback and if you interested uh, to purchase this application you are always uh, well most welcome <laughs> and uh, hopefully you will get it from the code canyon and price is uh, like uh, 49 so see you in the next video uh, thank you again so if you have any question or uh, technical related on how like uh, project structure and uh, how signal are works uh, so we'll give you the details of video so that you after the uh, getting the code you can easily uh, run this project and you easily enhance this application so thank you see you in the next video Okay, so I'm just closing this uh, video now. So I already explained like and sending the real time message. So I will attach the live uh, URL, also the purchase link, also the uh, my details so that you can uh, contact if required. Thank you.